All right, day eight, advent of code. Here we go. I see. Okay, I can do the brute force thing. Oh, I should have done slicing. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, if the new tree is tall or equal to, and we just break. if we get to the end. Seems kind of wrong, but I'll try it. Not the right answer. Let's see. Hmm. Twenty one trees. What am I missing on? one of these directions is true. Hmm. 
minimum of five is visible. The three, oh, sorry, probably this one. Three is not because, yeah, we see something higher. In theory, if we did this, we would get the same answer. Yeah, okay. Oh, why is this not working? I have a bug here somewhere. Shoot. These are the four cardinal directions. says that this one is false. Okay, that's not visible. Center three, it's not visible. Two, one. This one should be visible, but we're getting not. Why is it not? Um, okay, so two, one. Oh, shoot. Oh. This should just be I and J. 21, okay. Scenic score. Okay. Viewing distance into the four directions. Okay. Um, we keep going. We keep a counter. Every time we do this, we'll just have a one. Okay. And and we will what is the highest scenic score, okay? I think. Wait, maybe. I can see two trees. Okay. So we'd go one, two. This one. Let's see. Hmm. Something went on here. I thought adding one was correct, but maybe it's not. Okay, 
And so this one would be 1, 2. 1, 2 looks like 3, 1, 2, 2. That's not what this is getting. Okay. So the first direction is going to be 0, 1, which is going to be looking right. So looking right, we can see 1, 2. Oh, if we hit the edge, then we need to break. Um, I think this, or sorry, then I think we don't need to count the last one. So one if um, let's try this two one two one. Um, I think this is maybe right. This seems more correct. Oh, I was kind of close to leaderboarding on that part. Oh man, first day where I did not leaderboard on either part. Oh, that's kind of sad. Uh, what did I do to my global global position? Fell down to six. Okay, I I could have fallen a lot more. I think I'm okay with that. Oh man, yeah, that's a tough day for me. I oh that bug was. I I'm trying to think it to what extent was it like that I did not read the question correctly versus I knew what the question said and I just wrote the wrong thing. Um, but yeah, basically what I did wrong there was, oh, also, why does this have color? Anyways, um, cool, so what I did wrong, so it says, so we've got this grid of trees, right? Each number is the height of the tree. Um, and it basically wants us to determine if a tree is visible or not. Um, and it's visible if, like, if looking from either the left, above, the right, or below, you can see that tree. And you can see the tree if there's no taller trees in the way. So you can't see this three from below because the five is in the way, right? Um, well, anyways, basically, uh, I still the grid is, like, kind of small. It's 100 by 100, or I think it's 99 by 99. Um, and so basically, you can just go through each tree, and you could just go up right, down, and left, and see, like, am, is this tree visible? Do that for every tree. Uh, which is kind of like a an n squared where n is the number of trees. Um, the, oh, sorry, is that true? Um, no, it's like, it's n by n. If the grid is n by n trees, then it's n cubed. But n cubed is fine for, like, 100. It'd be, like, n to the one and a half, if you assume n is the number of trees. And, and anyways, it doesn't really matter. Um, uh, but basically, the mistake that I made was when you go in a direction, you want to stop as soon as you see a number that is like top, like at least as large as the current number. So you actually can't see over the same tree. So if we were at this three, we'd go right, we'd see the three, and then we'd stop. Um, and but what's a different example? Oh yeah, but the bug that I had. Uh, or like, so if you look at this five, right? If you're going right, you would see the three, three is smaller than five, you keep going, you see the three, the three is smaller than the five, you keep going, and so on and so forth, and you'd be able to see it. What I did was instead of comparing the height of each tree against like the current one, like the five, I would compare it to the previous one I looked at. So I'd compare three against five, uh, but then since I'm still going to the right, I compare this three against this three, and say, oh, you can't see a three from behind a three, so this five is not visible, which like, does not make sense. It's not correct. Um, and that bug was basically like, here I should be using the original IJ. Um, and originally I was using like, and I was using like the previous tree that we looked at. Um, if it was the case that you could see over the same height, then you could do like this. And I think these conditions would be, uh, they would not be equivalent actually. And anyways, um, I guess there's like some interpretation where the thing I wrote originally makes sense, but uh, it's not the uh, it's not the question that was asked. Part two was decent, although I also no, I actually had a bug in part two as well, um, which is that I have this counter, and the idea is that the counter like checks to see how many. Well, so part two is asking us now says like we want to compute the scenic score, which depends on like how far you can see from from the tree in each direction. Um, and luckily, my code was already pretty well set up to do that. Um, so I have this counter, and I just like added one. 
each time we made it further in this loop. Um, the problem is, is that like it does one extra iteration sort of when it reaches the end. Um, so like from this five going to the right, you can only see two other trees. Um, but I think my code would have given it like a three because I, I would say like, Oh, we go over one, we go over two, and then we go over like the third time. That's not exactly what was happening, but it's pretty close to what was happening. Um, and the fix is basically to check uh, whether I went like out of bounds. Um, yeah, I guess the other thing I could have done is I could have done um, this, and then I think this also just works. Yeah, that's probably the cleaner way to do it. Um, I I sort of did something weird there. I like I sort of subtracted one at the same time as I like got rid of this. And anyways, um, these those do work out to be the same thing. But uh, yeah, uh, it's a little sad that I could have made leaderboard. But I guess even if I did make leaderboard on this one, I would not have gotten that many points. So not a huge loss. Um, hopefully tomorrow is better. But yeah, that's uh, that's it for today. I will call the recording here.